what you explore increases. If you explore the area of spiritual growth and strength, it will increase. If you explore sleep, it will increase. These two guys came to me where I was ministering yesterday. And they got back home maybe around one. There's a possibility. All of them or some of them were still in the prayer this morning. 6 a.m. Some of you have holidays. You are just sleeping like Jonah. Because you have been used to sleep. The reason why we have not been coming for prayer in the morning before is not because you didn't have time. It's because you didn't have mind for it. Time is created when mind is made up. That's why they say where there is a will, there is a way. Now, the reason why I'm saying this to you, I want you to listen to me because God is present on my hand. The reason why I'm saying this to you, you pursue after anything at most on earth. None of yours here can be more than 120. I bet you. If you are more than 120, come and, come and take 2 billion euro from me. You can't be more than 120. On earth. You go. The house, you will leave. The cars, you will leave. You will not face stark reality of eternity. You will face stark reality of eternity. As we are talking now, standing here, the Lord being gracious to us, we will see the new year, 2023. It means nothing to God. The Gregorian, is it Gregorian calendar? Huh? Gregorian calendar means nothing to God. It's human being. Clock means nothing to God. That's chronos. It's times and seasons that means everything to God, not clock. It changes times and seasons, not change year. Year is by human being. Some will not see 2023 Gregorian calendar 2020. They will not see it and they are still jumping up and down now. Say, oh, my job, they're going to increase my salary in 2023. I does not know it's not going to see 2023. It's not a cause. That's why mortuary did not close down. Okay, if everybody's going to see 2023, let them close down mortuary. Then you find that body on the road. You will say you will not be able to go. You don't know that they quickly take care of many things. That's the reason why we don't know there are many dead. Mortuary quickly take care of many things. Even we didn't go away. When COVID-19 was going on, how many dead did you see physically? And they were dying, going at everyone, and they were taking care of them in the hospital there. There are people that is their own personal job. They are the ones who know how many people die in God. And they have been used to it. It doesn't mean anything. It's like rat die. And that's a whole eternity ahead of them. I want you to take seriously anything that explores spiritual growth. That is your own, that is your real life. According to Corinthians chapter 3. God impressed this on my heart. I'm not the one teaching today. Pastor Mirella is going to teach, but we're going to be living here at night by the grace of God. Explore what makes you grow spiritually. Don't explore what makes you decrease in spiritual transactions. And the ecosystem of spiritual growth is funded by a lot of contact and activities that take time. And I repeat that to you. I repeat that to you. 2023 has already been decided by how somebody is, what he is doing right now. And they have to be around contact and activities, spiritual activities that take time. The ecosystem of spiritual growth is funded, is funded primarily and only by many contact and spiritual activities that take time. People are all over several mountains in several places, calling upon God, creating time away, throwing away their phone. Some people are going to be coming on the 31st to come and call on the God they have not known from the first. And now that God will answer, I don't know. But as pastors, we are not deceiving anybody. 
We will declare blessing. I declare blessing. I declare blessing. But blessing only rests on those who have sought for it before they came. Almost everybody that Jesus healed, he said, great is your faith. Where did they get the faith? Well, see, where, when they met Jesus, that they got the faith. They have gotten the faith a long time. Faith comes by hearing, don't forget, and hearing the word of God. It will seem to you, what is this pastor saying? He's supposed to be thanking us. We come around. We have always been coming around. Uh -huh. In some other churches, they don't come around. Uh, my brother, my sister, if that is what is in your heart, you are not helping any pastor by coming around. You help your own personal destiny and eternity. Pastor has his life. You have your life. I've been driving around since Sunday, since we finished there on Sunday. I could pretend to be at home because as we wanted to come, Ebenezer became hot. Very, very hot. Not just hot. He became very clingy. Everybody went out of the room where I was. He came to me, clinging to me. I want to be with you. I want to watch what you are watching. And I began to touch me. And as I touched his body, it's very hot. I pray for him and I cover him with the duvet to sleep. If you ask me what did I want to do today, I want to send the mother to come here so that I can sleep with him so that he continue to sleep. The mother even asked me in the process of preparing to come that as we go and wake up Ebenezer and I say, still leave him. Still leave him. I had an excuse. The baby is hot and then the rapture takes place and you and the hot baby the hot baby go pure. <laughs> the baby, because everything is a test and everything is a trap. Did you hear me? Everything is what? They didn't mark somebody. The angel was coming to give somebody baby. They said the person was not coming to choir meeting. But the person was in the church. The angel now said the person does not come to church. This is an ask how you say the person that he goes he goes to the church say no he's from the choir we mark our own register these things are as serious as i'm talking about them except you have another god outside of the god of abraham isaac and jacob whom we serve you may have because judas had another god only that people didn't know his belly was his god and he was taking money. The rest of them that were not taking the money, Jesus was telling them the truth. If they wanted to succeed, if they didn't listen to Jesus, they would have fallen very flat without succeeding. Every time he would raise up an accusation, we are supposed to take this money to feed the poor. We are supposed to take this money to, put it, to feed the poor. If they have joined him, they will have died. They will have what? That's the one you've got to be careful. Eh? Everybody. I heard it from a pastor many, many years as I was growing up. You know what we learn from spiritual father is not the anointing. You are the one that will have to cry for your own anointing. It's secret and stories. Pastor Luby Johnson, one of our fathers in the faith, he said, be very careful when you get back home, depending on how you look at the face of your wife. He said, sometime before you go back home, they have eaten forbidden fruit. Don't partake. Don't become another either. It could be husband also. That's why I ask my wife that is seated in this place. If anything happens between her and anybody, she's to blame. Mercy was with us in the car. Ibukun is listening to me. Mercy was with us in the car. We were talking about Ibukun. And I said, I want more relationship with Ibukun. And on it, it lies on you. It does not lie on Ibukun. It was a heated argument for some time. No matter what I say, I say, I don't, I don't care. See, it's to blame for anything that goes wrong with anybody. Because I won't eat forbidden fruit. I won't come to a point where I'm covering my wife up and she's not able to succeed or make it to eternity. That's what you should learn. That's what you should learn. Because breast and vagina, they twist brain. You may not know when it has started twisting your brain. I'm telling you, for everybody, for everybody, they twist brain. Kisses and hugs, they change mind. That's the why they told Moses told them, say, judges, you must never accept any gift. Because it will change your mind. 
And is there any gift that is bigger than Cosmorico? No, for a man. That's the one that is nobody who does not change after they get married. Except people who are old, who have tasted everything about life. And it doesn't mean anything to them anymore. Money changes people. Women changes people. Power and fame changes people. Yes, all the time. Don't you see that Kanye West is talking more about God and cool because billionaire status is gone. He said, maybe God doesn't want me to be saying it, that uh, I'm, a, I'm a Christian billionaire. Maybe God doesn't want it, but I know God got me. Uh, he will forgive my sin. I said, ah, no, no, no. <laughs> he was telling people, even as a Christian billionaire, that if you don't make the kind of money that I make, why should I listen to you? <laughs> Some of you will not even know that money changes you. It changes people. Women changes, change people. Even men change women. They say, I'm married now. Everybody should know where to talk to me. But we are asked if you are 50 years old, you are not married. The holiness, the humility. Because life is dealing with you. There are other things that now deal with us, even in marriage. That's why people who are wise, anything God does for them, the Bible said that is forgiveness with God, so that men may fear before Him. Anything God does with you, to so make you fear Him the more. He does everything He does to you to make you fear Him, because there is something greater than what you have that will knock you out if you do not fear God with what you have. Because everything in this life is transient. Everything. Everything in this life. Very transient. Only God is permanent. That's why you don't allow anything to change your brain. You only allow the fear of God to run and rule you. Don't ever allow anything to change your brain. Don't ever allow anything to change your brain. Oh, sex is regular. Food is regular. You know? Woman is regular. Man is regular. It may not be regular anymore. I was telling my wife. No, I was telling Daddy Boko back in um, APO Joe, back in whatever I said. Yesterday we were talking about how to take care of your wife, how to look at it from the angle of God and make sure that you do everything God wants to do. I said, some of my fathers in the faith are around 70 something. Their wife just left them. You didn't hear me? Pastor Berlin, the wife left him. Pastor Chris, the wife left. Has not returned. Without the anointing. So if you think anything is totally permanent, it's a lie. The king of my city had microphone and he said, you know, last year I was in sorrow. And people didn't know because they, he said they told me that my wife could leave me. I did not believe because we were too much in love. And it was too connecting to believe. But all of a sudden the wife just moved out of the house and announced on Instagram. Around this time last year, just announced on in Instagram. Uh, what happened has happened. I cannot put my head under what is not. It's from Instagram, the king of my city. The most important king in Nigeria had that the wife has left. <laughs> Only you cannot leave you. That is if you are not drunk. If, if you smoke, you can become 3D person. <laughs> you are not the personalization. You now see yourself outside. And somebody was telling me that they smoke together and drink together and they, and they say sometime after we finished smoking there, uh, the person has to stay around for some time because so that he can cool down because he's really high. <laughs> My life is good. Only fasting makes me <laughs> And if Jesus meets me there is heaven. Only fasting. The only guilt that I have is that from time to time I eat when I'm supposed to fast. That's the only guilt. Outside of that, nothing. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Nothing must control you in this life. Don't let your job control you. Don't let fame control you. The Bible says when your money increases, when your, when your riches increase, He said do not sort your eyes on it because everything is a spirit. You are with your husband today because a, a spirit binds you to him. The spirit of God. If that spirit lives, especially if one of you begins to smoke weed, the spirit will just leave. You will not be looking at the person as a baboon. Say, no, I can't be with the baboon for all of them. 
Your mind will just change. Your mind will just change. Is it not immediately that guy, that guy ate forbidden fruit? Adam just looked naked. He said, wow, ugly. You are just even so naked you don't know. As soon as he ate forbidden fruit, he just changed. He began to clothe ourselves with different kind of materials. And say, heat so that you can. Don't eat with who heat. What God does not want you to eat. That's why in this church I warn all of you. Even when somebody is backsliding, I say I didn't send you to him. Let anybody that wants to enjoy their backsliding, let them enjoy. Especially this season that everybody is praying. Lock yourself inside your room and pray your own prayer so that your own head will not backslide. Anybody can enjoy their backsliding. If God wants them saved, they'll be saved. If God does not want them to be saved. One day I was thinking about Chichi as I was driving past and I wanted to cry. God said, what are you crying about? You've done everything you needed to do. He's regretting the decisions he made now. That's what God told me. You can go and find it out. If he has the chance of being around you, he will take the chances one million times. Because the righteous is more excellent than his neighbor. So much excellence is, is, is exhibited in the life of a person who is rooted in the fear of God. It's an eternal excellence. Joy of many generations. It is the truth. I can never go down. I can never go down. You meet me in front. You meet me high up there. I can never, never go down. Never. Because the righteous are flawed is like the sun we read today, the sun righteous are flooding like the palm tree. You know, planted in the house of God, there's a flourish in the court of God. In the old age, there's a be fat, there's a be fat and flourish. In the old age, there's a bring forth fruit. So even in the old age, Pastor Deboye, Pastor Kumi, in the old age, they are even shining more now than they used to be as boys. To so, show so that the Lord is upright, He is my rock. There is no unrighteousness in it. That's why boys. You just started. You, you just started fasting. You just started praying. You just got born again anyway. You you are writing that some people are saying apostle general. That's for people who want to hand it before they start. They are the apostle general on Facebook. Even me, I'm learning. I don't even know anything. I've not succeeded in anything. But I know I will not die a feeling. I've not succeeded in If you ask me, have I succeeded in anything? Not even in marriage, I can't. And I tell you, I've succeeded. How? I will tell you, I've succeeded in marriage when my grandchildren begin to preach faith. And they have churches of thousands of people that they are pastors. That's what I'm looking for. Ebenezer said, I'll be a builder. I'll build many houses for people. But as a, but at the same time, a preacher. He was saying it in the car. Why you the ones he was saying it to that? I want to build houses. That I'll be, be building houses. I want to build houses for people. I'll be building houses, but I'll also be a pastor. I said, that's the way to talk. And I didn't tell him what to say. Because if you are an architect and you're not a pastor, as grandchildren of Pastor David, it's a failure. Is anything greater than preaching the gospel? Every other thing is fake. Even your job. Everything is fake. The whole art is founded on the sea. And established upon the flood. Does it look real? They say your house is on the sea. <laughs> Big ships. Waves will come. They say there are about seven kind of waves. Waves will come. Big seas that is as big as this whole industrial estate. Take it all. And put it down. Is that where you want to be? Reverend Duke said he went to London with his children. On ferry. From North Carolina. He said, Everybody permitted to the Everybody permitted back. He said, He told himself, This is the. This is the. This one that is just two minutes. From Northern Ireland to. Uh, only once have I crossed it from Etro. And I needed to cross to. Cross to. Uh, west of London. And I. There is no kind of prayer I didn't pray. Even for those 15 minutes. <laughs> because I don't. So the whole earth is suspended on the water. Does it make sense? Does it make sense? Just about 12 months ago, people were studying medicine in Ukraine. 
and they were sending to people in Nigeria. I will soon finish my medical study. It just remained one year. Some people were medical medical officers, consultant, professors in the university. Two days later, flight military just came, just a friend, friend. They became refugees in other countries. Now everybody is writing now. Go back to your country, you Ukrainians. Go back to your country. They now became refugees in Europe. You think it cannot happen to Ireland? That doesn't even have any power. Only God is saving us. Don't make them out. Because Britain will just go and use their tail to look for one problem. And most people always think that Ireland is part of Britain. They just pray, map after everything. <laughs> They just become a refugee in Nigeria. Everybody will go. You, your country will not be beautiful, Africa, because they are not touching. <laughs> you now be asking, "Hello, the net is I'm in Congo." <laughs> Hello, Ruben, say I left the net in Congo. I'm in Malawi. <laughs> Many husband and wife have not seen each other. Many husband and wife have not seen each other over the years. Over this year in Ukraine, many husband and wife have not seen each other. Many husbands and wife have not seen each other. Many husbands and wife have not seen each other. So there is nothing in all of these things. So the complaint that they have bombed is the one that will say, no, you can be working effectually, uh, uh, you know, from, uh, from home. You know, you can be working. They don't even have a place of work anymore. The only thing that is sure is what enters your spirit. Write it down. The only thing that is sure is what enters your spirit. The only thing that is sure is what enters your spirit. And it's so sure and sure forever. Don't play with spiritual growth. As we go in into 2023, don't play with Bible studies. Where God builds your faith and washes your character. Don't pray with prayer meeting. I went to, 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 to Kide and I told Pastor Sade, I said, Major reason that I came here, number one, I came to see Ibukun and see Ibukun's parents. Then I came to remove death from the church here. And I said, I'm going to go around our churches like that until I settle down in the new year. I go to, to Athlone. Uh, I will be here on Sunday, on Friday and whatever. And I'll, I'll be in Athlone on Sunday. Next Sunday, I'm going to be in Dublin. Then I'll settle and leave everything in the end of everything. Because some of the things I'm seeing around are terrible. And we took time there. I preached for about one hour. And we took time to pray for about one hour. And we prayed about many things. Pastor Sade came this morning and said, I think this prayer that we, you came to do is about me. I said, talk about it. I said, I had a revelation. Because I've always had Mami Bukuto help me with my neck. That my neck is paining me. But in my revelation today, I saw the woman who was sitting on my neck. That it was a whole woman that was sitting. Why are you hearing the testimony? Sitting on my neck. And the woman said, yes, I'm sitting on it. And the muscles are coming out. And I told Pastor Sade, the reason why you were feeling what you were feeling physically was because something was going on spiritually. That is what they call yoke. It was affecting some aspect of your life spiritually. And if they are sitting on your neck, if lion grab your neck, if he grab your leg, you can still run. You can take a little. Go. <laughs> grab. Once lion is able to grab neck, what else remains? And that is how she was delivered. She battled the woman out. And Pastor Sade said, I'm delivered. Mama, because I also said, I had the revelation. In my revelation, I came out of something very dangerous. And then in my right hand, I received keys to a house. And the other one, keys to a car. I said, that's a break. Instant reward to the prayers we went to pray there. Don't play with prayers. One day, we will come to pray. Lost will leave you. Like this one said, that the spirit of lust was chasing the two of them. It was the two of you. Since that year, he didn't tell you. It's the two of you. It's you and I that the spirit of lust, that revelation he was speaking, it was you. But after some time, Jesus came and laid hand on her and the own, her own spirit, the lust left. Otherwise, he would have been sleeping with other men, even within the church. Don't, don't, say, don't say that. Somebody was speaking with me yesterday night. When prayer was going on, I was speaking with some of my mates around 12. And they said, one of them said, I have a friend now, they are both Christians. He said, one of them, the wife is just a little sick in the hospital. And my sister is already helping the brother. Don't ever say anything cannot happen. Just grow. 
Write it down. Don't ever say anything cannot happen. Just grow. Just grow spiritually. Don't ever say something cannot happen. And if you grow, you won't know which day you come for prayer meeting. As you come for the prayer meeting, the spirit of lust comes out. The spirit of greed comes out. The spirit of laziness comes out. The yoke on your neck comes out. The pain in your knees comes out. That is a, is a, is a, is a physical pointer to a deeper spiritual matter. What was happening to Pastor Sade was a physical pointer to a deeper spiritual matter. It cannot just be about pain in the neck. Don't play. People who are going to gym are still going to gym. Christmas or no Christmas. They won't stop their regime. And they say, don't they have Christmas holiday break in that their church? Did they force you to come and come there? <laughs> I will have all the day the day I know that they said that the devil goes on break. <laughs> When they say the devil goes on break, that is not tapping with anybody, you know. It is this holiday some people go away. They just say, oh, oh, honey, just leave me to just go with my parents, you know. I just want to have some time with them. And by the time the wife comes back to say, well, honey, can we start preparing for our divorce? I don't think this marriage is for me. Although I've been with you for 15 years, but I really don't think it's for me. There is no number of years, Ruben. That a woman has stayed with you or a man has stayed with you that they cannot still go. People go at old age. Have you not watched some of those African videos? We are at old age. Father and mother are fight. Grandma and grandma are fighting. Have you not seen them? Refight. Have you not? I've watched some of them. There is no teeth anymore. And they are fighting, putting themselves down. If these guys have chance to divorce, <laughs> that will be the... Let's stand up on our feet and just give God praise and ask the Lord. To prepare your heart for the word coming to As the Lord, share with your friends and your relations. Share on Facebook with your friends and your relations. Barado barano cabos co barado gabos cadabrano de adam. Barado cabos co baranda capas co baranda handas. Zusu prana cabos co parada cabado de ata. Zacarama do brado cabado de anta cabado de ata. Marata kabado de anta kabado de anta prano bredushki padada prada kabado de has pa my hands let the spirit of grace and supplication fall upon my life grace to seek you grace to to run greedily after you grace to be diligent heart contact and spiritual activities that take time for me to grow and become who you want me to be. Masakora Mado Kabaron Handa. Marakabado. There's an unreasonable level of growth that can change your life. I was talking with Senab the other day. I said, Do you notice? Do you notice that the month, the week, the, the week that Sinaj was giving birth to her baby? She was in she was in what Lakewood Church. In America, singing. I didn't even know she was pregnant. And that same week she came back. And Pastor Chris said, oh, yesterday. She was in the service today. Say, yesterday, Sinaj had a baby. Unreasonable level of strength. Some of you, only one finger is paining you. As a, uh, the prayer meeting and the choir meeting and the supplication meeting. With uh, the Bible study, cancer, they say, the doctor said, I should rest the finger. <laughs> you are a mockery to yourself. Because even the devil is laughing. <laughs> In their community, they say, <laughs> they say, this one is a clown. A total clown. Some people will feel cramped. They say, hey, it's crampy. It's... Does it crampy the day of your interview for, for work? Say, it's crampy. And I when they want to do it, they will not be doing it around this. He say, sorry, it's the woman issue. What is the woman issue? Pilot are doing pilot. Pilot who is booked to pilot. With the cramp. Just take template to five people who want to know. Soldier, soldier crampy. Soldier woman. <laughs> the, <laughs> Afghanistan is shooting. You know, I say, mm, they will meet me when I tell them cramp. <laughs> they will just, <laughs> they have been looking for cramp before. 
Because this Afghanistan soldier that is fighting, they are looking for any woman. Any. <laughs> People who have been sleeping with Ayana. <laughs> that they tie Ayana down sleeping with Ayana. And as they cram. But what would they cram? You will be pregnant ten times in a day for them. Those people who like, they are like a henna. <laughs> you see, you see, if you see them. That is a super grace that superimposes itself over weakness. Lift up your hands to heaven. Say in the name of Jesus. Say it out loud with all your heart. Say, I receive super grace that imposes itself over weaknesses of life. Know that I may serve the Lord acceptably with all strength. Go ahead and pray it. Go ahead and pray it. Parano prenos kabado de ata. Parado kabosko paranda kabarona. Parato kemorama nato me enle temarodi. Roha prona kabado karama do de ata. Zi eprona koma som prado gabado de. Receive grace. Say amen. Receive grace. Receive grace. Over weaknesses. Receive strength. Receive grace. Receive strength. In the name of Jesus. To stand up and be counted to serve the Lord. In the name of Jesus. Extraordinarily. Receive grace. Receive strength. Receive grace. In Jesus name. Amen.